dear brethren and sisters, this is to remind us who we are, where we reside, where is our residence. Hallelujah. The Bible says, but you have come to Mount Zion, the city of the living God. Hallelujah. The Lord God that manifests. Hallelujah. The Lord God that speaks. Hallelujah. The Lord God. Hallelujah. That has miracles, wonders, and signs. Hallelujah. We have come to the heavenly Jerusalem. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. This is where we stand. We need always to remind ourselves, to remind our minds, our body, our soul, and our spirit. Hallelujah. That we have come to Mount Zion. Hallelujah. Where there are thousands upon thousands of angels in joyful assembly to the church of the firstborn whose names are written in heaven. Hallelujah. Let us never lose focus of the aim of our faith is to go to heaven, to have our names written in heaven. Hallelujah. But how do we get there? We need always to have in remembrance in our minds who we are. Hallelujah. Our identity. We have come to God, the judge of all. Hallelujah. We have come to the spirits of the righteous made perfect. Hallelujah. Mount Zion, that is where our citizenship is. Hallelujah. To Jesus, the mediator of a new covenant. Hallelujah. And to the blood that speaks better than the blood of Abel. Hallelujah. Do you know who you are? We have to stand like David. Hallelujah. We, we have to stand like David. Hallelujah. Not just see the mountain where the armies are standing against the Philistines as a, just a normal mountain. Hallelujah. When we see that mountain in 1 Samuel chapter 17, is the mount is the mountain of zion hallelujah we see our lord god who is living we see signs miracles and wonders we see healing and deliverance in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ we see the sprinkled blood that speaks better than the blood of abel hallelujah it says in revelations they overcame by the blood of the lamb they overcame by the word of testimony hallelujah they overcame by not being afraid up to the point of death this is david hallelujah this is David. This is what he saw when he went to that mountain where um, the giant was, the, the Philistines giant, hallelujah, where he had to fight this 2.8 meters uh, giant. David saw beyond what the rest of the army of Israel was seeing because they were afraid and dismayed. But when David arrived, hallelujah, he remembered who he, who he was. He remembered his God, the exploits of his God, hallelujah. Amos 1 verse 2, hallelujah. But the Lord God rose from Zion. He thunders from Jerusalem. Hallelujah. This is what was in the mind of David. How are you feeling as you face things like hunger? How are you feeling as you have wars, civil wars uh, in your countries? How are you feeling as you are going through trials and tribulations of these end times? Hallelujah. Are you seeing hunger or you see beyond hunger? Are you realizing you are from Zion? Hallelujah. The Lord God Almighty rose from Zion. Hallelujah. He thunders. That is where you reside. Hallelujah. You have the thunder of God on your side. You have the roaring of God on your side. You have the, the, the sprinkled blood 
on your side and you have no fear you have to face what you are fighting with no fear like david hallelujah then victory becomes yours you need to meditate every day speak and speak hallelujah victory is mine winning is mine hallelujah because from zion where you reside the lord god almighty speaks and summons the earth not only in the morning not only in the afternoon not only in the evening but he summons the whole earth from from sunrise to sunset yes that the bible says from zion he shines he shines forth from zion his light shines forth and that is where your citizen is psalm 50 verse 1 and 2 yes we need to keep on meditating on this such that as we face our wars we 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 face them head on hallelujah remembering where we stand on in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ i speak and declare healing right now i speak and declare hallelujah deliverance in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet i decree and declare that you are free right now right now right now in jesus mighty name hallelujah those that jewel in zion shall never say they are sick in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ indeed none of us is sick because we are free we are free you are free right now in the mighty name of our lord jesus christ hallelujah i decree and declare the sprinkled blood that speaks better than than able in jesus mighty name